Now, in the event that Dilma Rousseff does get impeached, her vice president, Mikhail Temer, would become the country's interim head of state. CCTV's Lucretia Franco has more on the man that may be a few votes away from taking the highest office in Brazil. Until now, Michel Temer has largely governed in Rousseff's shadow. Accused by Rousseff of conspiring against her, he's now poised to replace her as Brazil's head of state. The 75-year-old lawyer is a senior member of the centrist Brazilian Democratic Movement Party, as is Eduardo Cunha, the suspended Speaker of the House, who led the drive to impeach Rousseff. Temer kept a low profile, but in April, he practiced an acceptance speech for the presidency before the House voted to impeach. Someone leaked a recording. When the Chamber of Deputies decides by a significant vote to declare authorization to establish an impeachment process against the president... He said that was before the impeachment process started in the lower house. Rousseff called Temer a conspirator and usurper. Before the vote of an inconsistent request of impeachment, audio was distributed where one of the leaders of the conspiracy took on the position of president of the republic. Temer denies plotting against Rousseff and has otherwise limited his comments on the matter. The only thing I want to say, and the only thing I will repeat, is that I will wait silently and respectfully for the Senate's decision. Before that, I can't say anything. However, Brazil's possible interim president is an unpopular choice to replace Rousseff. A recent poll showed that only 8% said they would support Rousseff's impeachment if it meant Temer would take over though he hasn't been implicated in the Petrobras bribery scandal, many politicians in his party have been charged, and his name has been mentioned in investigations. But if Temer's popularity is low among Brazilians, he also has powerful support. He's a pro-business politician and has expressed his desire for a government that will unify and recover the country's economic stability even if that runs counter to the policies of his former coalition partner, Dilma Rousseff. Lucrecia Franco, CCTV, Rio de Janeiro.